Dreadache snack for that is too short to be serious. Woo! I just hate doing night reviews. But when you just can't, you can't, I, you just can't sometimes, folks. You just can't. So, Shake Shack, there's only one in my area. It's in Virginia Beach. I work from 9 to 5. It's getting that time of year where the sun's going to be down at 5 o'clock, my friends. It's 7 o'clock now. I had to do a crumble review. And, you know, Virginia Beach is already out of the way. So, when I go to crumble, you know, I'm going to Shake Shack. So we're out, we're out here doing another night review at Shake Shack. Get used to it because I don't feel like going on a Saturday or Sunday. When I'm going all the way to Virginia Beach for Crumble, we're going to keep doing that. We're going to keep doing that. That's just how it is. Um, and, you know, I, the lighting could have been a lot better um, had they had quicker service. But, you know, they were not quick enough and now it's dark. So I'm under the best lighting I could find. Um, there's a street light and I got this little light on if i cut the other one on it looks makes the lighting look absolutely terrible so my apologies i'm ranting um i just i don't know i wish i had more time on my hands life was better with free time and uh you know just seeing my channel kind of struggle because i don't have the time to do these reviews when i want to do them and how i want to do them it it's it's a it's a pain it's it makes me just sad Ooh, yeah, I'm overreacting. But yeah, so Shake Shack, some new items. Don't know how much longer they'll have those uh, milk bar uh, themed shakes, but go check that review out. Um, but yeah, so they got three new citrus or well, lemonade drinks. I'll be trying those next week, and uh, you know, just keep your eye out for that. But here we are. I've got the truffle burger, which has a black truffle sauce. Uh, gear, gear, uh, cheese, and shallots, which is basically fried onions. And then you've got Parmesan cheese fries uh, with uh, truffle sauce. So let's just quit yapping and get to eating. All right, so please subscribe to my uh, YouTube channel, Redneck Snack, of course. Check out my Instagram also with the same name, Redneck Snack. And like, comment, and share this video. I need y'all get me out there I really need that I need your help because these nine to five days are taking away my you know availability to get these reviews done at the now I like that I like the like the headlights over there they're kind of helping my lighting real quick but then they're gonna be gone and I'm gonna be sad so all right let's try and do our best with the thumbnail Ooh, that's yeah that's gonna be a terrible thumbnail and I apologize You know, that, the headlight just flashed again. That might have just been my thumbnail. The half a second right there, that might have been my thumbnail. So, anyways, let's stop wasting time. Start eating. So, I'll eat one of these fries alone. They're pretty good for crinkle cut fries. And you got that Parmesan cheese that adds a nice flavor profile. Now, the truffle sauce, it's not like a black truffle sauce. It's more of like a, a white... You can get, you get some black specks in there, but it's mostly white, as you can see. Um, here's a French fry with the, the Parmesan. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and try this out. I love truffle. It is a weird flavor profile. It's hard to kind of describe. It's kind of like vinegary in a, in a way. You know, it, it is a mushroom. Truffle is kind of pulled from a mushroom. And so... It's kind of got that kind of flavor to it, too. It's like a vinegar and mushroom kind of cross. Um, you know, it's very reminiscent of, uh, you know, vinegar chips, in a way. Plus, you know, that added mushroom, herby flavor. Again, if you've ever had truffle, you know what it's like. But it's just kind of hard to describe it. You have to have it. And I would think most people have had it by now, but not everyone. That makes sense. So this sauce really drives home that truffle flavor, but it's not just truffle. Like, 
there's a hint of sweetness, there's a hint of tang. It's kind of like a, a truffle mayo, if you will. Now there's this brand called Truff. Um, well, they call themselves Sauce on Instagram, but their packaging says Truff. And a lot of uh, you know influencers have been sent packages to try. I would love to get to try some Truff. I really would. Um, I hear it's some good stuff. I love truffle. I just love truffle. Um, and if it's anything like this sauce, I can tell you it's a good one. For sure. Like, I'm obsessed with this. And you get the Parmesan cheese, too. This reminds me of just going to a restaurant and get some truffle-infused uh, fries. Mmm. That's exactly what you get here. But again, you get that added tang and sweetness that's in this sauce. Mm. Again, it is different. It's not for everyone. I know people who hate truffle. But I think this is really good. Like The whole experience of the sauce with the Parmesan cheese fries, it's just a 10 out of 10 right here. You know, Shake Shack, this surprises me sometimes. Like... I always have high expectations for their milkshakes. But the food is overpriced. And the portions aren't the hugest. But then they just come out of nowhere. And it's like, wow. You know, when, when it touches your taste buds. It's amazing. It's really good. Top five in burgers, I think. You know, very top tier for fast food, fast casual. Same for their chicken sandwich. Top tier. Just really good quality food. So 10 out of 10 for the fries. Now let's get into the burger. I probably should have started there. But I like to eat my sides first. Don't y'all like to eat your sides first, you know? Um, but yeah, again, it's a, it got a truffle sauce, guy here, cheese, and shallots. There's a good look at it. The best I can give you. You know, I, I apologize. Lighting is lighting. And we deal with it. And now, I'm kind of dealing with it. When I pressed that, the light was gone. All right. Mm. This is a greasy delight. It's on a potato bun, by the way. And for some reason, I'm telling myself I can taste potato in this thing. It got a little bit of weird taste to it. I think that's the shallots there. Sometimes when you get these greasy things, the grease can kind of just linger a little too long and kind of just wreck the taste of it. And I think that's an issue. Um, I definitely think I like the fries better. I'm not getting a lot of truffle flavor here. Yeah, it's just not as present. I guess there, and it might be the, I really think it's the grease and the shallots, but, um, and it could be the cheese as well. Let me just grab a little bit of this cheese. I think that might be an issue as well. Yeah, it's the cheese too. So, honestly, I just don't think it works together as well as one might think it would. The truffle sauce, I don't know. It just feels like it's missing. But it's there, it's, I can see the, I can see the truffle. I don't hate it, but I don't love it either, uh, which is weird. Just think about how much I really like those fries, and this burger just doesn't seem like it's it, you know? I think it has some interesting flavor profiles. Um, I think it's unique. I like the bun. It's nice and soft. Of course, the beef is always good quality, but I don't know. Here and there, I really like it, but our times, it's just, you know, I'll give it a six, um, a little pricey. You may not want to get it. You may not. You might just want to get the fries, the sauces to die for. Maybe you just get a regular cheeseburger or fries and then pour that sauce on your burger. But I'm not sure, I'm not sure if they are, they, they have the same sauce. Good likelihood that it is the same sauce, but I just think 
that kind of gets lost in this burger. So just take that with a grain of salt, if you will. But that's my review. Fries, 10. Burger, 6. So every now and then it's just like, mm. And other time it's like, whoa. Like when they did that Korean stuff. Oh my goodness. The chicken. The shakes. Oh. I want those back. I love the black sugar shake. Yeah, there's a lot of Shake Shack reviews I've done. So if you ever have any curiosity, what I've seen, what I've done, what I've tried, just go watch those videos too. It's a good time. Anyways, that's my review. I'm sticking to it, and I will see y'all around. Yay!